Hey, what's up again, everybody? It's Robert184, 2 rs 2 bs Gundam.TK, and Gundam Uniform is continuing to dominate uh, upcoming model releases, as it has been doing for the last few years, and even though it had been the Unicorn Gundam, it seems like the Shinanju is going to be getting in on the game. I still remember when it first came out thinking, ah, there's only going to be one release of this, how silly I was. In February, we're going to be getting the Shinanju Stein, which is looking pretty interesting with lots of changes to the armor. But in this case, it's just been announced that in March, instead of the version K in the nice white box that we've seen on shelves for years, it's going to be instead the anime version. They're not calling it an OVA version so far. For a price of 7,500 yen, it is going to have the same base as the version KA. The only thing is, is that it's going to have the bazooka added to it. And so far, some of the information we've picked up is that the frame is going to be replaced. The ABS plastic that it used to be is going to become paintable plastic. Or so it would seem, which is sort of interesting, and I wonder if it's going to have any relationship to the MG new version KA. Could there be new replacement hands? I guess there's still more to be seen. And as the hobby mags come out with more information, there's text only in this month's, uh, so I'm sure we're going to find out more. When you combine that with the fact that we're going to be getting all sorts of different uh, banshees and all sorts of different robot damashis of full armors and in unicorn and destroy mode, it just seems like there is no stopping this unicorn juggernaut. You've got to wonder if episode 7 is even going to wrap things up. But in the meantime, is there anybody who hasn't bought the Shinanju, uh, like me, who's going to be pretty excited to get his hands on an OVA one? They made a quite a few imp improvements to the regular Unicorn Gundam in the Master Grade. Well, not quite a few, but three or four, and it just seems enough between the V-fins and the better knees that if they're not good, they may not be going that far, but nonetheless, for anybody who hasn't passed it up, or who has passed it up, it's a nice chance to hop on board the Shinanju train, which seems to be almost everybody's favorite bad guy. Anyway, everybody, love to hear your thoughts and speculation, and of course, stick around. There'll be more news leading up to the release, and of course, stick around for reviews, news, and lots more stuff like this. So carrying on in the long tradition of version KAs getting printed twice. Anyway, everybody, as always, thanks for watching. Let me know what you think. We'll see you next time. Bye.